your girl Miss Fluffy back with another video back with another video but today's video I'll be making shrimp and broccoli guys shrimp and broccoli one pot meal quick easy and delicious y'all already know <laughs> if you're new to my channel don't forget to subscribe and turn on your notification if you're old you're returning back to my channel welcome back to the fluffiness okay if you keep coming back watching my videos and haven't subscribed yet you know what please do so is that okay because i <laughs> your girl is waiting okay guys y'all can't miss this video now because this shrimp and broccoli turned out bomb this thing was so delicious let me stop rambling okay also don't forget to follow me on my social medias <laughs> Without further ado, let's get into the video. All right, guys, what you're going to need to make this shrimp and broccoli, obviously you'll need some uh, shrimp. I'm using medium size. You can use any size shrimp you want. And I'm using the one with the tail still attached to it. You can use whatever you want. And you're going to need broccoli, onion, bell pepper. I'm using green. And I have some orange over there, orange color. you need some thyme. Also, you need some Maggie adobo. Y'all can see adobo jerk seasoning and chili powder. That's all you're gonna need. Oh, and some oil. Definitely gonna need some oil. So I'm gonna put these aside, and I'm gonna start cutting up my broccoli. I'm really just cutting off the stem. I mean, I mean the stem is very important. It's very healthy, but ah. Too tough for me. I'm just cut it off, cut the cooking time in half. So I don't have to worry about it. I mean, if you want to cook that, so be it. I'm gonna still leave a little bit on it. See right there? Yes. So just cut these up how big or how small you want it. It's all up to you. I don't want mine too small. And I don't want it too big. So these look good. That took less. Let me zoom in on that. That took me no time at all, guys. <laughs> One second. So I'm going to just transfer it over to a plate. Transfer it over. Already rinsed my broccoli, guys. It's already rinsed and clean. So I'm going to go with my bell pepper. I'm going to cut this. Hold on. I'm just cutting hold on. I'm just cutting off the old piece from previous usage. Alright. Let me get close up so y'all can see. That's better. And I'm using just three fourths of this orange one. You don't have to get rid of the seed completely. The seeds are fine. They're not bothering you. Don't bother them. <laughs> Let me just cut these up. You can cut them up however you want to. You can do squares. You can do rectangles. <laughs> whatever you want. And if you don't like bell pepper, you can definitely... Uh, skip this step for sure you don't have to use bell pepper if you don't want to it's not a crime it's not a crime I'm just cut these up like so let me get out this part right here all right guys I love bell pepper with some veggie dip tastes so good Tastes so so good. You can just eat these raw. Oh, so good. Put these aside. I'm gonna cut my onion. I'm not gonna use a big piece of onion, just a little. Just a little piece. Oh, let me clean this up. Yeah, I'm gonna just peel this off like that. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I'm like all over the place. I'm not even in frame. I'm just rinse this off. And 
and I'm just cut it up. Okay, make sure y'all can see me. You don't want big pieces of onion, just small pieces or medium, medium pieces. Oh, I almost forgot my um, garlic. I got some minced garlic, I'm gonna also add that in there. So this is the veggies. They are so pretty. I love them, I can eat, I'm gonna eat this right now. Mm, 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 mm. So, so good. Very sweet. Mm -hmm. So I'm just put these in a bowl. We're gonna saute this first and we're gonna saute these up in that oil this is so pretty i'm gonna clean up clean up the mess and i'll be right back all right guys so right now i have the temp on um medium high i'm gonna go on with some oil you can use whatever oil you want i'm just using canola i'm just using some canola oil i'm gonna just shake this bad boy around you don't want to use too much oil just a little bit will do the trick and just fine. So I'm gonna go with my bell peppers and onion. Ooh. All right, hold up, I'm gonna get my garlic. And I'm gonna go in with a little bit of minced garlic. Just a little bit. Mix this around. Whoa, this looks so good already. Wow, if y'all can smell this kitchen. Divine, divine, divine. So I'm gonna do. I'm gonna add some adobo on my season on my veggies. Give it some flavor. Season it up just a little bit. So we're gonna add some more. With the shrimp. So let this bad boy mix up. You're not going to saute it all the way through. About a minute or so. But you still want the crunchiness. You still want the colors to pop. So I'm going to cover this up. And I'll be right back. When I come back, I'm going to add the shrimp. Alrighty, guys. Like I told y'all, not too long. Not too long, a minute or so. This looks so good, so pretty. So I'm gonna cut my temp up a little bit, push my veggies to the side, and I'm gonna go in with my shrimp. Cut the light up on that. I'm gonna go in with my shrimp. I left the tail on it. You can take the tail off if you don't want it on yours or whatever. I already rinsed it, I already cleaned it up. All that goodness. So make sure you add in all your shrimp. I'm using just about the whole bag. And this is a 12 ounce bag. So I'm going to go in with my seasoning. I'm going with my chili powder. Honestly, this is not spicy. <clears throat> this is not spicy. To me, this is cake. And then I'm going to go with my adobo. Not too, too much. If y'all know from previous videos, like, don't put too much Maggie in there. Just a little bit. I'm using a little bit. Because I and I life depends on it. Just a little bit. And then I'm going to go with my jerk seasoning. Jerk confide. Just one spoon of that and we'll be good. Everything got to be jerked up. Jerked up. Jerked up. And you can't forget about your time. I'm just rinse off a little bit. Put this time in here. Yes. Let's mix this around. We're going to make a gravy out of this. Make sure your temp is on high. 
because the shrimp still got a little bit of water on it still a little frozen just a tad bit so i'm gonna cover this up and let it cook we're gonna make a gravy and then when we make the gravy then we're gonna add in our broccoli then we're gonna add in our broccoli after we make the gravy oh yeah you're gonna need some ketchup for sure to make the gravy you already know if you don't know ketchup goes in everything <laughs> Jamaican tradition. Tell them it's fluffy. Said that. <laughs> so come. All right, guys. I, all right, guys. I swear it hasn't been two minutes yet. And look at this. You see the shrimp already produced its own juice. You see that? Two minutes. I'm gonna just mix this up. Remember, shrimp don't take long to cook, and this is medium size shrimp. I'm gonna go in with a little bit of water. That's going to help with the gravy. And then ketchup. This is what's going to thicken up the gravy. You want your gravy to be thick. So not too much ketchup though. Pretty sure the shrimp done cook already. Don't take long at all. See that? This looks so good guys. If y'all could smell it in here, up in this kitchen. So I'm going with my clean cut up broccoli. Let me show y'all the shrimp. All right, looks good to me. If y'all don't feel comfortable doing that, you could cut the shrimp on the side and then add it in your veggies. If that's, if that will make you feel comfortable but everything is gonna cook down. Make sure your shrimp is cooked through first. Then you add in your broccoli. I'm gonna add just a little bit more water. Just a little bit. I'm gonna cover this up and just let it do its thing. One pot meal. Healthy one pot meal, kind of healthy. <laughs> so come back. All right guys, let's take a look inside. Whoa. Oh, whoa, yes, there's that light. Oh, yes. Oh, no, come back down, light. You too much. You're doing too much. There you go. All right, there you go. This looks good. Wow, guys. If y'all could smell this kitchen right now, that time, if y'all haven't used time before, make sure y'all get some time because time be popping. Whoa. So good. Let me zoom up on here so y'all can see. Bring it up to you guys. Hold on. There you go. This looks so good. Y'all can't tell me nothing. Nobody can tell me nothing. <laughs> oh, man. So I'm going to cover this up and just let the gravy cook down some more. And that's it. Chick, shrimp and broccoli. I almost said chicken and broccoli. <laughs> but that is it, guys. That is it. I'm going to show you all the final results soon. Alrighty, guys. This is it. This is it. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe to my channel for more awesomeness. Y'all can't tell me this don't look good now. I know this look good. Y'all know this look good. <laughs> Oh my goodness, this is amazing. Catch y'all on the next one. And also, don't forget to check out my other videos, guys. I got plenty of videos out. Go check those out. Go check those out as well. Catch y'all on the next one. Bye.